Uh, if you're watching this video, you probably have a heavily planted tank or a high-tech tank. And, uh, you know, I went through a lot of stuff in the beginning of trying to get my tank dialed in. I had way too much nutrients with the soil and everything. So this is just a video to maybe help somebody out just getting into this. Obviously, you don't have to have all these here. Um, definitely for beginners, you want the flourish and you want the iron. All this other stuff here is not 100% necessary, you know, unless you want to go crazy uh, on the tank and have stuff just growing like mad crazy, like carpets and stuff like that. You know, if you're doing java ferns and all that, technically you don't even need this stuff. You can put a couple of root tabs, uh, you know, with Nubius or, you know, anything like that that you're going to put in gravel or anything. So, um, if you're going to go the high tech route, what I do is. I do every single one of these probably once every three days. I do them all at the same time. And uh, that's the way I found uh, where I get the least amount of algae outbreak and I get the best growth. And uh, as you can see, carpet is coming in quite nice. Two carpeting plants. I got the Glosso Stigma and the S Rippins um, right there behind it. So everything is going pretty good in this tank that stuff's going like crazy I mean just growing wild in there and I also had too much light in the beginning so you know watch how much light you put on your tank and uh, watch your furts that you're putting in I don't know about too many other furts on the market but these um, I mean you can't go wrong with just about any flourish product they make the only one I've bought that wasn't any good was that uh, Clarify or the water clarifier that that was a total piece of shit. Don't ever buy it